totally different dude. Get ready for the next battle, battle, battle. Yeah, let the record be set straight. Cusif, <laughs> I don't even know if he's ever played Guilty Gear in his life. Maybe. Possibly. All right, here we are for those of you just joining us at Xanadu. We're here at VG Boot Camp. Twitch.tv slash VG Boot Camp, of course. If you like what you see here, please throw us a follow. Please sub if you'd like. We'd very much appreciate that. If you got and Amazon Prime especially, you got that free sub. Where else are you going to spend it, huh? Definitely. Definitely Forcing? here at your local. Don't do that. Spend it here. And for those of you in the area, please... If you believe you can knock down any of these competitors, please come out. I have a whole bunch of people on my Facebook talking trash, but they don't ever come out. You know, that's a that's a <laughs> thing, right? Online <laughs> warriors, they like to talk, don't they? It's easy to talk when you can send a message and go make yourself a PB sandwich or something. <laughs> Look, at, did you mm. see that LUT trying to, to punish the orbital heal and it was just no bueno. It's hard, it's a hard punish. I think there's a one direction you can step it to and then get the punish, but that's about it. One direction. <laughs> Round two. Hey, you said it. Fight. <laughs> oh, I hate myself already. <laughs> Don't hate yourself, man. You're doing fine. All hey, right. I, I, I love these two competitors. Look at them. Cusif and Lud? Oh, yeah. For sure. Cusif, yeah, definitely dominating. I, I feel like, mm. how come we don't see him more often down here? Um, he usually works on um, Thursdays, and he doesn't drive. I, I picked him up and brought him out here. Of course, I should have learned my lesson. Did you just see that? Yep. Are you Brutal. kidding me? Are you kidding me? Getting counter hit. Oh, wait, no. He um hit him with the back four at the wall into jet upper. That was crazy. Yeah, it's guaranteed unless it's at a bad angle. And right. again, no punish on that. Rimini, Cusif, mm. playing so optimal all of a sudden. I love that move. Ooh, that was a jet upper. Yeah, Lud flailing a little bit here. Mm. Okay, there we go. Counter hit, soccer kick. And patch a kick into soccer kick. <gasps> Good stuff. Ooh. I like the four whiff punish. And look at this. Cusif is kind of playing from a script at this point, I think. Yep. Right? A little bit on autopilot. Ooh, good back three. I don't think he feels threatened by Lud. And here we go. Hey, and, that, a good and that's how you get attention. hit by the back three. That's true. <laughs> All right. Love's going to end up going low. Oh, no. Not even. Two mids. Beautiful. Round four. I definitely would have gotten hit by it, too. Fight. Ooh. Tries to side mm. up a down four. No Good. bueno. I'm loving the... I love the little small punishes you get. When you block the low and you hit it with rising four. Perfect. Every little bit of damage counts. Yeah, in a game of such high damage, you know, mm. you learn over oh, a long Oh, no. Time. So much damage. And then we get the taunt. Taunt into the 4 2 one, four. Yeah. That's the first time we've seen that. We've seen him go for that plenty of times. Yeah, I got hit by, like, three times earlier today. Oh, snap. Not in tournament, in casuals. Yeah, we've seen him go <laughs> for that a lot of times, and that's the first time we've seen the actual taunt successful and then the real link, right? The real combo. Fight. All right, Lud just needs to take this one game at a time. I don't know what that lava in the background's made of, but it looks delicious. <laughs> I don't know, it doesn't look like uh, it doesn't look dangerous at all. Mm. Yeah, oh my lord, the rising threes! Mm -hmm. Oh, didn't make it to the wall, but he still got wall pressure. Up, oh, beautiful duck on the can cans. Round two, fight. Just, Go ahead. Just single buttons. Oh my lord, the jab out. Too bad we can't do that against Orbital. So optimal that walk. <laughs> oh my like lord, that. the back four into the four four two. Oh, he thought there was all. He thought the three was coming. <gasps> The mm. duck again, Cusif, so dominating. Round three. Who is this man? Fight. He's a legend. <gasps> Good punish there. Yeah, Lud's been, Lud's been getting all the punishes on those down back threes. I love it. Yeah, nope. Uh, can you even punish? What is Jet I don't know. Block? 
minus jet 10, upper I think? is jet upper is minus nine, but it is a high. Uh, right. That doesn't help you if you block it. Ooh. No, it does not. Here we go, all the way to the wall. But it does mean that you, you can set up your turn for offense. I love the combo variety we're seeing from QSIF. A lot of personality, right? Really expressing himself by varying his combos. Not going for, not playing the numbers. And QSIF, a 3-0. And that should be 2-0 QSIF, right? Yup. I don't know why it's not popping up on your stream. It's popping up on mine. Oh, oh, oh. yeah, they just, uh, yeah, don't worry about that. It's yeah, not important. <laughs> Yeah, the people on the stream, they don't know about this screen on the left. <laughs> That's this is a private screen, fine. okay? Invite only. <laughs> VIP screen on the left. As long as the one on the right shows them what they need, we good. As right. Long as the one... All right. And we're just getting more pokes in. What a display of Tekken fundamentals. Every time you see a chance for even a small punish, you're seeing it for the most part. And we're, and we're seeing Lud get a lot of good side steps in. He's pretty much trying to shut up all the side steps with the pokes. Ooh, good down forward too. Oh, look at that! Look at—he missed the juggle, and he still com he went. He really committed to the whole thing. I think he was hoping that Kusif would wake quick up roll or something. Yeah, wake up wrong. But he takes this round. Yeah, not the full wall damage. A little bit weird, right? A little bit at an angle. Wall creates a little uncertainty for uh, for Love there. Ooh, big counter hit. That's the thing about Brian. Them counter hits hurt. Mm. He realized right in time that that back three wasn't connecting. And then just the quick clean back dashes away. Ken, we're just gonna. Round three. Fight. Ooh, Ooh blocking the hatchet kick, but uh, I'm pretty that, sure. that can't be. She can get a better punish yeah, than that. Yeah, she. I believe she has a better punish for that. Okay. But that is a beautiful combo to the wall. Yeah. A big 60% of life gone. <clears throat> Let's keep getting them um, four forward ones in. Mm, hatchet kick, soccer kick. Ooh, almost a punish on that four there. Yeah, the limbs, man, Asuka, she's a defensive character. So seeing Lud trying to play this whiff punishy game, I feel like this is just not the right character for that game plan, right? Asuka is the kind of character you want to play when you want to be tricky. So Asuka's got good offensive options, good defensive options. She's a pretty complete character. Oh my lord, where did his life go? <gasps> Look at that, ducking under the offense. I like that. Like getting a little tricky, being a little more active here, trying to work his way forward. I like that. Knowing that playing the numbers in Tekken is not always a sure way to victory when you're sitting on, you know, one poke away from death. When you're one poke away from death, you got to make you your comeback happen. Things. You, you go slightly solid and try and chip away for it, although that's kind of risky. Or you make your comeback happen. Yeah, right? by going for something risky. And oh my lord, the big counter hit rising three. I feel like that's just been the story. Interesting. Okay, Qsif, I like that. The last minute confirmed there. Conversion into the best damage he can. Ooh, look at that, just letting that orbital rock right in front I of his face. I think that one he might actually been able to get the forward two punish on. Big rising one. Uh, ooh, he drops the combo. Rare sight for QSEF. All right, thrown in the grab game. I like it. Good parry. Pulls a little bit closer to the wall. That might have been matched. And this is love. Oh, and the grab. Comeback like I said. Step the second he starts grabbing, step. he gets a game. That's what I like to see. Don't just make him block and duck. Make him break some grabs. Ooh, Although QSEF is pretty good at breaking grabs. Yeah, you expect any <laughs> legacy Tekken player to be, you know. But he uh, did not break the one that counted. He did, Yeah, that's true. That's true. Yeah, so many grabs at the end there from Lud. I'm surprised we didn't All see right, a duck from QSEF. Lud's laughing. I'm guessing QSEF said something. QSEF is a funny guy. Yeah? I'm sorry. If we put him on commentary, I, I would listen and I would just laugh. <laughs> <laughs> Hope we get to see him up here then. One day, maybe. We just need all... Um, people to send him out of this tournament before top three. Oh yeah, that's the <laughs> challenge, right? We need people to donate their talents, all those online warriors out there in the MDBA. Yeah. We, we, need to pull, we need to pull Seiko back, Thai Man back, Victim of Ritual. No, those people come out. We need <laughs> Yusuf to come out when those people are around. True, I, I'll see what I can do about getting them out more. Yeah, it's snowy, right? Oh yeah, it is snowing outside. Can't expect everyone to come out. So I'm glad Qsif came out. <gasps> Look yeah. at that. Just fanning off blood right there oh. with that orbital heal. Mm -mm. Mm. I see you're sweaty here in the ring. Let me fan you off with an orbital. 
Mm, good sidestep. Oh, Ooh, oh he doesn't okay. go for the low afterwards. Round two. I mean, all fight. Yeah, even a one two I think could have cleared it. Yeah, from the up one there. two would have killed. I don't know if he believed in the punish. No, it doesn't seem like he, he knows. Did. He knows it now though. I think he might actually be able to get. She might be able to get the two four off of that, which is a real big punish. Or is it four two four? <gasps> Oh, the pe that's oh, the first no. spring we've seen. And it works. Oh, oh my man. lord, the taunt pressure. That is like the fifth taunt that that whiffed. You know what I'm saying? He just went into the knees after the taunt. Ludge just trying to escape that taunt setup. Ends up getting hit anyway. Ooh, back three, one plus two. I don't understand the reason why, but it works. And big damage coming in. Good, good, si good side roll for the taunt. Oh, big Snake low. Edge. Oh, I guess it didn't combo. <gasps> the backdash from Qsif. Ooh, good grab. Mm. KO. Round and I think the biggest thing is Fight. the amount he, he lands at least one or two counter hit rising threes every single round. I think that's uh, I think that's back four or forward four. We're th we're thinking of or back three or four or three. No. Man, I need to play more Brian. That's what this really See, signifies. The first hit of that yeah. is rising three. Okay. So it's rising three four. He's been getting them with the rising three. A that, lot. that right there is is quarter circle four with three, right? Listen, that's not important. <laughs> we'll, we'll, we'll clear up the notation later. What's yeah. more important is discussing the thought process behind these two guys. And look at that, breaking the grab again. And mock it. Bam, Cusif taking it home. Final round. That's it. Three one. <laughs> we have our Xanadu champion, Cusif.